You will need to remove the engine covers to access and replace the MAF. Please see our article and video on engine cover removals by following the link at the end of this video. With the air covers off, you can see the MAF sensor housing at the rear of the engine, as indicated by the red arrow, along with the harness, yellow arrow. Disconnect the harness, red arrow, by squeezing in the two clips together and pulling it from the housing. Use a flathead screwdriver and release the clip, red arrow, that holds the sensor housing to the intake manifold, yellow arrows. Slip the mount off the housing. Here you can see the center clip, red arrow, and the clips that hold the MAF to the manifold, yellow arrow. Wiggle the housing off the end of the throttle body. You will have to disconnect the breather tube, red arrow, to remove it completely from the engine. This photo illustrates the two clips, red arrows, that hold the housing to the throttle body. There is a small clip, red arrow, on the rear of the housing that you need to slide back so you can pull the MAF sensor housing from the other housing. There are two T20 Torx security screws, red arrows, that hold the MAF sensor in the housing. You can remove these with the housing in or out of the car. If you are just replacing or cleaning the sensor and aren't interested in cleaning the housings, you do not need to remove the housings. Only clean the sensor with MAF sensor cleaner and never touch the sensor film, red arrow, with anything. Installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.